We are just three days away from Christmas. Today, one of the busiest travel days of the year. Officials at Philadelphia International Airport expect to see some 700,000 travelers now through the new year. Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore explains why more people are traveling home this holiday season. Warm embrace from mom and dad after nearly a year stationed in Hawaii. It's great. Glad to be back in Jersey. We're in Philly right now, but Jersey a little bit. This 21 year old Marine is home just in time for the holidays. He says getting here was stress free. Traveling's like the second, second nature to me now. But Austin Cole's parents could not shake the anxiety as they waited for Cole at Philadelphia International Airport Sunday. I'm ecstatic. No. It's just like there's nothing like him being home. And while Chris Cole wears red, white, and blue in honor of his son, I'm super proud of my son. I couldn't ask for a better Christmas present. Cole is kicking off his holiday vacation thinking of Eagles Green. What's um, the first thing you're going to do. Good okay. It was one hug after the other as flights landed at PHL. Some of those taking off took holiday spirit to new heights. I get to see my parents like once or twice a year, so I like making a big thing of it. And Matt Johnson got through security screening in a breeze. You don't got to take off your shoes, keep your liquids in your bag. It's super easy. AAA says enrolling in TSA PreCheck, always a good idea. The agency says 7 million people will fly this holiday, the largest number experts have seen in 16 years. AAA is attributing that to the strong economy that we've had in recent years. So we always tell people get here two hours early during the holiday season. We tell people to give yourself even more time. Good advice wherever you might go this holiday. This marks the last year and holiday travel season before federal real ID enforcement begins. At Philadelphia International Airport, Crystal Cranmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News.